guys? We have some very special today, and it is the AMD Ryzen Threadripper 3990X 64 core 128 thread processor. And as it says in the title, we're unboxing it. So let's get right to it. I am quite excited to see what is in this box. Oh, looks like there's a box in a box or something like that. Oh wow, it says AMD right there. This is their best processor yet. Oh wow. Okay, so there's a sticker. There's a sticker, it says AMD Ryzen Threadripper, that is cool. And here we have the processor itself is in this little box. It looks like that seal will break on its own. Don't want to ruin it. I want to keep the box. Ah, oh, perfect. Oh, wow. How are you supposed to get this out? Okay, that pops out. Oh, here's the processor itself. 3990X. 64 cores. That is crazy. Oh. And also, this is an AMD processor. It's interesting how it doesn't use pins that stick out of, process out of the processor. Instead, it's a, a flat grid on the back. Um, yeah, it's like the, let's say the Ryzen 9. Oh wow, that's a big sticker. That is a big sticker. Anyway, yeah. The Ryzen 9 processor, that, or 7 or 5 or 3, they all have pins sticking out the back. But this one, I'll show you, does not have pins sticking out the back. Instead, it's a flat grid of pins. Not really pins, but pads where the motherboard makes contact with it. Okay, what else do we get in the box? We get a mounting bracket for a liquid cooler. We're not going to be liquid cooling this thing, it's air cooling. Uh, you'll see that in a, a future video. Okay, spoiler alert, it's gonna be a Noctua NHU14S TR4, I believe. I think that's what its name is. Alright, here is the tool that you use to uh, remove and install an AMD processor. Alright, time to install it. Um, what you're about to see will be recycled into that video I'm going to be making. So, yeah, let's install this processor. Time to install this thing. So if you look carefully here, it says open. I don't know, wait, the lighting isn't that good. Let's see, block off some of the lighting. No, it's now focusing on my hand. But it says open at the bottom, three, two, one. So we we'll want to undo bolt number three. Want to drop this anywhere? All right, three, two. Sorry, you can't really see that. I'll move my other hand. I'm just trying to want to drop that anywhere. Oh, see, that's what I mean. Actually, three, I don't think it's, okay, it is. Now one. So there's a very specific pattern that is required to open this thing. I think that's all the way, okay, yeah, that is all the way. Great. Now, Slide out the, it says, caution, slide out the external cap before sliding in the carrier frame with CPU. There's, uh, wait, I thought this is supposed to pop up. Uh, 
stop. Hold up. All right, so I guess you just gotta pry back at these two things and pull it up. I believe that's how you do it. Let's try that again. Like that. And now get your fingers there and pull up on that. And it pops right out. And now you'll want to, you'll want to take your CPU. It better not drop out of the carrier frame. Oh, that's a heavy CPU. Oh my God. That's heavy. Okay, I'm holding it by the carrier frame only. Slide it in and lower it. Okay, there it is. Now it clicks. Now you want to just push down on those. Good. And now this. <clears throat> Notice how it says close one, two, three. So we want to tighten bolt one till it clicks, bolt two, then three. You'll need to use this tool to torque it down to exact specification. When you hear that click, wait. Oh, ooh, you don't want to do that. I don't want to slip. Um. Yep, there it goes. It, it clicked. Now two. Same process. Turn it till it clicks. If you heard that. I'm wearing AirPods right now. I hope the audio is being recorded by the iPad, not my AirPods. You wouldn't have heard that click. Come on, hurry up. Is it even tightening? Sure, don't feel like it. I'm twisting it so many times. Uh, something's wrong. I'll get back to you. All right, guys. Oh wait, the light turned on. Sorry. Ah, oh, the flashlight turned on. I don't know how to disable that, but anyway, you'll just have to bear with me. So. Tighten this one again. So it clicks like that. And then this one, number two. Clicked. Now number three. All right, click. Now our CPU is installed. Now it's just time to install the cooler. Uh, everyone's cooler is different. So if you're seeing this clip in the 3990X unboxing and installation, then uh, I'm not gonna show it. But if you're watching the, I don't know, whatever this video is called, the, whatever, this PC build video, if you're watching a whole PC build video, stay because uh, I am showing you the installation of it. Yeah, this clip will be recycled in two different videos.